How's it going, everybody? My name is Daniel from Hazardous Entertainment, and welcome back to some more Minecraft Build the Earth Winston-Salem. Uh, today, we are starting on a new little project over here. This is Camino Bakery. Again. This is their secondary location, and I've already built up the exterior, as you see here. It's a much smaller location than their, uh, uh, than their location over at uh, the Neeson Tower. But uh, I figured we could just get the interior of this one done today, and, uh, hey Camino, how are you doing? I know you saw my videos. I know we've been talking in the DMs. It's been great. Remember, you have a choice today. I hope you make the exact right choice today. But let's get into this one, <laughs> all cryptic, weird beef? Is it beef? Do I have beef? I don't think I have beef. So I've done a lot of detailing on the outside of this building, and uh, yeah, I'm pretty satisfied with it. There might be some changes here, but I really wasn't wanting to do the exterior of the building. Uh, I wanted to do the interior work, uh, but it put up the sign here. I like this. Uh, they, their, their logo is like a, a shell because it's a reference to the Camino, um, which is a trail that you can take. I believe it goes through Spain and France. Um, and so I just put the sign up as it appears and I put a few stop signs a little bit of street detailing There's some weird plaque here um, And this nice little front facade with this black stone here um, And so we're just gonna get started on the inside and I've gone ahead and it's dark. Why is it dark? I put lights in here. Why is it? Why is it dark? Just gonna light update the lighting apparently that's build the earth for you So I've got oh my my brightness may be moody right now. I, I realize I better yeah, I definitely need to change that. I'm, <laughs> that's much better, much lighter in here. We can see what we're doing now. So let's not waste any time. Let's get into it. We're basically going to be doing a lot of the same processes that we did uh, at the other Brookstown. Not the other Brookstown, the other Camino location. This is the Brookstown location. There's a void basement down here because they think that's uh, storage and employees only. Uh, so we can't build that, but we're going to be building up here. And I think, yeah, I'm going to take a quick trip over and get all of the uh, necessary pieces uh, that I had in my inventory for the other location, so we're gonna take a quick trip over there. Yeah, this is a much farther location from uh, from everything else we've been building. It's coming up pretty soon. I think, where is... where in the world? Okay, there's the, uh, there's the BB&T Tower. Oh yeah, things have come into view now. We're, we're here. So we're here, back at the Neeson Tower, and I'm just gonna pick up that chest we left behind, because I knew it would come in handy. I told you guys it would come in handy. So we're gonna go in here and pick up that box, and we even have lighting errors over here. I'm not sure what that's all about, but... Uh, we'll just fix them as we see them. So I'm gonna pick up, let's get rid of our inventory real fast. Let's clear that out. And I'm just gonna pick up, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna pick up, can I do a, can I do a, ooh, I guess I can just, we'll just take everything and we'll put it back here when we're done. That's what we'll do. Good, oh god, we have so many t-shirts now. All right, let's get back to our main location. Before we head back, I wanna check out the, uh, the Reynolds Tower over here. I want to take another look at it, just cause it's, it's really nice. And if you didn't see the last episode, we finished a big RJR building, which is a huge landmark here in Winston. And as you can see, if the chunks will load. As you can see here, yeah, we finished it. Man, build the earth. You are, you are stuttering. Such a big mod pack, but it takes so much. Okay, I gotta increase my render disk. Well, that's why. That's why it was so bad. It was at eight. Who keeps their render distance at eight? Not me, I'm not an amateur. Uh, yes, yeah, so we built this whole complex up here, and it, it's looking really good, and I just wanted to take one more look at it. I haven't seen it since I uh, recorded last, so. Let's head back to the Brookstown location, and we'll get started. Okay, so we're back here at the Brookstown location, and I only have one reference picture to work with. I'm gonna slap that up on screen for you guys, and it's really the only one that I could find online, so unfortunately we're gonna maybe get a little bit more of the details off on this one, but we don't have as much room to decorate, so that's that's gonna be good. Okay, so right here we have the front serving area. So, we're gonna do... Uh, looks like they got like a coffee machine. Like, there's like a box here. There's something going on here, so why don't we put... Yeah, let's do a, uh, a coffee maker, like right here. Yeah, maybe? Maybe that'll look good. And I know this is the cash register right here, and they, they've got... They used to have paneling up for COVID, but I don't think I'm gonna represent that. There is no COVID in Minecraft, are you kidding me? Um, and let's see, so we got right here, looks like we got another one of these, uh, like, display boxes. Um, and so I'm gonna go ahead and plop that up. That is incorrect, that's not what I intended to do. Um, I know there's a way that you can press blocks into things, like I could technically put a head inside this glass block, but 
the problem is when we're converting worlds and, and doing a lot of stuff, interacting with other uh, B team uh, teams, you can have a lot of issues when it comes to copy and pasting or world conversion. So what we're gonna do, which I think we just did this last time. Didn't we do this? Oh no, did I get rid of a? No, I'm good. Uh, yeah, I think we just did that last time, and that kind of acted as our as our display case. It's not, you can't put anything inside it, but you know, it, it tells the idea. <laughs> More of a fish tank once again. Uh, let's see, so we could do, ooh, they've got cookies displayed here. So why don't we try? <laughs> interesting, interesting. Let's do this. Let's make this as if it was, no, no, let's do, it's very still very dark in here. It's because the lighting, oh man, you step away from the lighting in BT for too long and suddenly everything goes to hell. Uh, let's see, let's do a, let's just make this a quartz stand, like that, because it's technically another glass display, but I want to be able to put something on here. And I think I'm going to put, do we have quiches? Uh, head database, search for quiche? Is this, how do you spell quiche? Yeah, that's how you spell quiche. Uh, they don't have any quiche. Pie? Maybe a pie would look good. Oh, well, pie can look quiche-like. There's some quiche looking pies here. Let's go with... Hmm, was it a PewDiePie? Let's put a PewDiePie in there. Uh, let's go with this one. This one looks nice. It's a muffin pie. We'll go with it. We can rock with that. Don't want this to look identical to the other location, but I want it to be, you know, the idea. So they got a muffin display. Here's... Oh man, pictures of quiches. Uh, so they've got another menu board, and I didn't represent the hanging version last time, but I think today I'm actually going to. So what I can do here is I, yeah, like right above their heads. Like, so if they're standing here, what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut up into the attic here real quick. And I'm going to place a, like that, and then like that. So now we can put a fence post on there. Or maybe, ooh, let's do bars, because it looks more like it's thin like an iron bar. So we'll do that and that. And now that's going to give us that hanging effect. But how do we do a chalkboard? We could do a full block of like coal. And maybe that'll look good, but there might be a way to utilize barrier blocks and a painting. Maybe. It's a bit bulky. So maybe there is that idea to operate with um, with barrier blocks. Barrier blocks being uh, invisible blocks that you can place things on. They're fully physical, but they just don't have any texture to them. So let's see about, because I can't give myself them, but let's see if we can't copy and paste. Can I replace coal block with barrier? No? No, oh, let me, oh wait, did I just, yeah, there we go. So now they're invisible blocks there, and now I should be able to take like paintings. If I can spell, today is not a good day for me when it comes to spelling. And you could do something akin to that, I guess. Oh, I gotta get rid of that if we're gonna do that painting. Yeah, I don't know. Is that the only painting that's gonna show up? I don't know, something like that. And, and maybe there's a better way to do that? Hmm, I think. Let me use my big brain real fast to make this work. And we'll figure it out. You know what, we'll stick with the painting concept. Let's just stick with that. Let's make it different paintings, though. You know, and you want to put it. You want to apply a texture to that. You know, get yourself a texture pack. That looks like chalkboard. By all means, go for it. But that's going to be our vanilla way of approaching it. I might change it still, but it looks pretty good from the front. It definitely, I can tell what that is. Let me bump this over real fast. Bump that over so you can see that extra detail. Yeah, that's looking really nice. That's looking good. Um. So next. Okay, so I've got a lot of actual shelves here. So let's get some stairs. And let's do some upside down, some of this, right? Is that gonna look good? Yeah, so it gives a person can stand right here at a cash register, which we, did we have that last time? We utilized one, but I don't see it stored in here. Ooh, we have coffee lids. A little bit of coffee lids right there. Yeah, maybe put it at an angle. There you go. Looks a little, make it a little messy. And I don't think they have, no, they don't sell alcohol at this location. So I don't have any use for the, uh, you know, the, the wine bottle texture that we had. Put a bagel. Put a bagel here. That's not a bagel. That's a bagel. Yeah, just nice. Nice having those out again. Um, and let's get, oh, let's get that uh, hash register. Is that gonna pop up? Yeah, 
Is that one? Is that a good texture for one? We will place a nice little cash register right there. Yeah, and you can serve your customers very nicely. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's see. So they've got, this is more of shelves here. So let's do, let's use some stone stairs to create this effect of like, <laughs> of like shelves like that. And then we could even do another one up. I can't put anything on these shelves, but you know what? I think there's only like a few pieces of bread, so we could, we could stack some bread on top here. Yeah, so let's get head database, search bread. I know they got a lot of bread textures. Look at all that. That's a nice bread texture right there. That's not too bad. And we'll, we could do <laughs> stacks. Is that a man? Is that Steve bread? Uh, bread of the dead. <laughs> Gingerbread man. Mutant bread. So we'll put a, a stack of toast and a bread roll up there. Looks a little too symmetrical. We'll do bread rolls are straight. Straight with the uh, the system. Yeah, that's looking really nice. We'll put the mutant bread down here. <laughs> that's where he goes. They're working on experiments down below. <laughs> they're working on they're working on new new innovative ways to make bread and they made a horrible mistake okay so that's there Ooh, let's put yeah let's do that finish off that nicely what do they have next oh they got another coffee maker so maybe we could actually use our coffee grinder because it looks nice the texture is good right here yeah that's pretty good and then we could do, do they have a fridge oh it looks like they have a fridge so maybe we'll do that and then we'll put some wool, maybe black wool, maybe maybe black. Let's do black concrete. All right. And then oh, we'll do that like that there. Then we will put a butt not. <laughs> you know, you never seen a fridge before? That's definitely a fridge. It doesn't look too bad, especially for what, you know, how cramped we are back there, but I think that's our kitchenette area done. Um, we may detail it. Ooh, we could act, we have one more space for things, and you always got to use all the space you got. Don't select the, the chest. Oh, okay, we could do a sideways mug. Um, bag of sugar? Maybe. <laughs> I'm not going to judge. Um, let's do, yeah, let's do a bag of sugar. No, oh, can of coffee beans. That'll, we'll put that on the display, but this is for, like, storage. So let's put a bag of sugar facing the proper way, because for some reason that's not facing the proper way. There you go. And let's put a thing of gr grinds right there. That's how you... Or maybe we'll put it up on the fridge. Keep that one clear. That's that, that's for the transactions. Transactional purposes. Um, I know they got a uh, t-shirt for sale somewhere. We'll do... We'll, we'll make that right here. So let's do a stair. Let's do a nice... Do some of that. Maybe. How's that gonna look? That's nice. And we'll put our shirts up on display. Let's do that different. There was that other shirt texture we didn't use. I think it was this one. Well, they sell different shirts here. Yeah, that's nice. That's nice looking. Okay, now I can't see what's over on this side uh, in this picture. I know there's the stairwell, and I think there's a like, a mug display. So we'll use our if I, ooh, it's very cramped in here. Uh, I will use the mug. The empty mug? Do I have an empty mug? Empty mug. Empty mug? <laughs> they could be selling medieval mugs. The closest one, we'll just do this. We'll just do this one. The closest thing I had is a sideways mug, but we'll do that. And look, now you can buy yourself a, a cup of joe. A cup of joe right there, sitting out. Um, and I know they used to have tables here, but I think they've gotten rid of those since COVID uh, to create more room for social distancing here. And so I think those tables are gone now. And all the other tables are over here. Now, I don't know the layout. And Camino, please don't get mad at me. Anyone who works there, anyone who eats there, please don't get mad at me. I just don't remember the layout, so I'm gonna improvise here. I am gonna put some paintings on the wall because, again, like the other location, they support a lot of local art. So I do know there's some paintings, if I can get those back out um, over here, that are often for sale. So we'll do like that. Ooh, well, <laughs> hold on. Let's, let's, oh, oh, oops. It really wants to fill in all of that space. Do like that. And that'll kind of give us the idea that there's art over there. Um, and then, you know what I want to do with this? You know what I want to do with this shelf? I want to make it into stairs. I want to do some spruce stairs. I want to do that. Nice big window. And this is also 
where you can come over and get uh, some necessary items like, you know, uh, extra lids. So let's use, ooh, let's do this one. I like, I like this texture a lot. Yeah, we'll do that. So this is where you can, someone, maybe someone's putting their, you know, sugar packets in their, their coffee over here. Who am I to judge? Who, what do I know? So let's slap some tables down and it looks like, give me a second, I gotta stretch my neck. Over here. Ooh. We're into the same problem we ran into with the other tables. See, I could do a really nice dark wood fence for the uh, the, the posts. I know there's like a t table like right here. I think there's a window here. So we're going to pretend there's two windows here just for fun. Um, I know that I could put like a carpet on top and it would look perfect. But then I can't put things on top of it. So... What do we do? What do I do? What should I do? What did we do last time? We just did stairs? We could just do stairs again. It's so thick and robust. Eh, well, it'll do. So I'm gonna line... Let's make a double table here. Yeah, do like a... Like a double table right here? Maybe like this? So they still have room to eat over here. They're not being intruded on by these people. And then we could do like a... Yeah, let's do this. Ooh, now they're getting intruded on again, but you know what? It's fine. We'll just do this. And we'll say that there's another one, you know, up here. Um, do like that. Like that. It's good. Yeah. And then we'll put some lighter. Oh, we could just do slabs. Would slabs look back? Because it looks like they're more like bench seats at these middle tables. Is that going to look terrible? Maybe. What do I know? Uh, like that? I don't know about that. Ooh, wait, wait, do we have... Maybe the head database has some, like, small bench. Search chair? No heads found. Stool? Stool! Oh, ooh, I, ooh, that's the answer. I love these. They'll be smaller, so you can tell what they are as well. And these will actually give us a really good chance to identify, like really good detail in a small space. We're going to go with the oak wood and we're going to use this one. And I think that's going to be how we do it. Oh, I could do the, I like the jungle wood on top. Where's, oh yeah. Okay. So this is what I want. I want this one with the, the natural wood on top. I have a sneeze. <laughs> bless me. Thank you. Put a bless you in the comments down below if you blessed me for that sneeze. <laughs> like one here, one here. Yeah? Is that looking good? Just do some nice stools. Hey, you guys seen the stools recently? There they are. Look at that. And I'll tell you what. I mean, it's a little chaotic. But you know what? It tells a story. There's really a story going on here. That's a little too crowded. Yeah, it's a little... <laughs> I gotta, excuse me, I gotta go to the stool to walk around here. How you guys doing? You guys need anything? You need any... Uh, I got cups. I got lids over here. You need some lids? So yeah, that's going to look nice. And I can see... So the interior walls are actually white. But we can't do that in Minecraft. Because you can't have double-edged walls. I wish you could. wish there was a way to do that. But there's really no good way to go about doing that. So we'll do some... There, there does appear to be white panels. And maybe we could do that with... Maybe we just use trapdoors? Oh, well these... Well these... But I'll need to power those somehow. Ah... That was going to work perfectly. I need to power them, though. We'll just do these. We'll just do a couple of these. How's that? Is that, that getting the point across? There's just, like, I don't know, it's just sound foam, I think. Like, like acoustic stuff. There's, ooh, there's an air conditioning vent. That's what it means I could just do this. Ah. 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 That'll do. Ooh, maybe not on that far one, because now it's impeding on that. Oh, I can't. Excuse me, I can't get through there. I can't punch my way out of that. There we go. Maybe like something like that. Yeah, it's given just a bit of weird detail. This is already looking pretty good. Let's line the walls with some more art. Uh, just for funsies. Because you, you, you know, shame in it. Yeah. That's looking not too bad. Not too shabby at all. And I think, you know what? I think for old time's sake, let's let's do this. The other one had it. Oh, we need to put some coffee on the, the tables. I forgot I haven't decorated the top of the tables. Coffee cup, coffee mug, coffee... hot chocolate. Okay, so let's put coffee cup, coffee mug, 
one of them. Let's do two two mugs there. And let's do a bun. <laughs> there you go. Maybe that's a bit too crowded right there. That's looking nice. It's not too bad at all. And let's top it all off with a nice sideways mug and a bit of brown carpet again. I think so. You know, somebody had an accident. Oh, no. Oh, and it's a major accident. It's huge. Somebody needs to clean up, clean up at the front of the Camino. And I think for a first pass on that, you know, we might change a few things. I think that's pretty good. I don't know about you guys, but that's feeling very, very Camino. It, ma it makes you feel very Camino. I feel like I could walk in where there's no balcony yet. Oops. And go, hey, give me a, give me a cup of joe. Oh, thank you so much. I'm going to drink this right now. I'm going to drink it. It's on the floor now. Uh, you got the nice, you know, we'll figure out something to do with that. There may be a better way I can think of that off, off screen. But then you leave and then you, you come outside and let's take a look at it from the outside. Much nicer, looks alive in there. Nothing, nothing going on at the top, but you know what? Let's get rid of that selection there. And that's looking pretty good. So I think I'm pretty satisfied with the interior of Camino. And of course we're going to go through, uh, and do a big expansion of the whole Brookstown area. Uh, but I think that's gonna do it for today's episode. Uh, so I'm gonna come right here, get one last look, look at that. But I think that's gonna do it for today, so uh, remember to like and subscribe. We're already getting underway on our next major project that's gonna come out next month. Look forward to these new videos, these smaller ones, every Saturday. Uh, be sure to hit the subscribe button so you can be updated every single time we do a new video. Uh, but as always, my name is Daniel, and I will see you guys next time.